Why do you look taller than me? Because I am taller than you. No, you're not. Yes, okay. I am. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Okay. So in today's video, I am back with my brother. We haven't filmed a video in a while and we thought it was about time to do another one. In today's video, Simi and I are going to be switching hair care routines. I've done this. Hair but, care routine. Yeah, I've done this before. I don't really see people do it with their siblings that they live with. So this will be interesting and it'll be really easy for us to use each other's products since we can just give them to each other. I know for a fact that I use a lot more hair products than he does. He has like three products and one of them is coconut oil. I'm really Really scared for how my hair is going to turn out with that. What's wrong with coconut oil? It's like heavy and greasy. It is heavy and greasy. I don't know how else to make sure my hair doesn't get dry. So I just slather on some <laughs> coconut oil. So that's what we're doing today. So we're just going to kind of switch products and see how see how our hair reacts to them. I think his hair will do good with my hair products. I don't know about me with his. I guess we'll just have to see. So I'm going to get all of my products. Oh. Okay. My hair routine for the day is gonna be a spray bottle, some coconut oil, even the bottle's greasy, some Cantu leave-in conditioner, <laughs> and this Aussie conditioner, which I know I like. I don't know how this combination is gonna work in my hair. Okay, I'm using weed style like gel. And then I'm using this. I thought it had no label. Oh, it's like custom. Yeah, you have to use my custom. They're actually really good. What? Is it is conditioner and then we have the function as the shampoo then we have miss Jessie's original honey curls sweet <laughs> almond oils and honey okay and then we have the blueberry bliss it says curls so obviously it's gonna work leave in conditioner yeah. yeah the last one Camille Rose the recipe for beauty <laughs> curl maker marshmallow and agave leaf extract yep Okay, can I at least get in like the shower to rinse my hair? Yeah, okay. Okay, so what you're gonna do is you're gonna get the Ozzy McMoist conditioner. Well, you're gonna obviously like take a shower and stuff. Do I use shampoo? You don't use shampoo, right? Not, no, not every day, of course. That's fine. But every day it turns into like... Never. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> so you're gonna get the conditioner and like obviously condition your hair, leave it in for like five minutes or whatever, then wash it out and then do whatever you do in the shower, get out of the shower. What I do is shake my hair a little bit while I'm in the shower so that it doesn't like drip everywhere in the bathroom. If you just came out of the shower, you don't need the spray bottle, but if you didn't take a shower before, then okay. you don't need it. Then you're gonna put in the leave-in conditioner. This is gonna be really weird for long hair. I have like relatively short hair, so all I do is just mix it around yeah. like that, but I don't know how you're gonna do that. And then do the same thing with the coconut oil. And then you can use the styling gel. To like keep it okay. style for the day and then shake it a lot and okay. then just let it dry and then for your hair routine you're gonna get in the shower you're gonna shampoo your hair you're gonna focus it on your scalp shampoo all that and then rinse it out you're gonna put the conditioner in let it sit for like five minutes then detangle your hair while in the shower oh. and then i do a specific order for these it kind of makes sense what order i go in this is out of the shower right yeah okay. well no actually you do it all in the shower when your hair is still like wet okay. so like whenever your hair is wet after you rinse it out squeeze it out like once and then you put these in so you put them in your hair when it's still really wet okay since i squeezed it is that out of the shower no oh okay just like you know like okay. bring it out a little bring bit and then you'll use your blueberry bliss leave-in conditioner and then you'll use miss jesse's honey curls and then you're going to use the curl maker and then lastly you're going to do gel which just kind of holds your curls in place okay the rest of the day so i'm pretty confident this is going to work in this hair i'm not confident who's going first me yeah you okay oh, i'm scared like if you're subscribed to me you guys will know how different this is from my normal routine i just put my products in my hair when my hair is still really wet well it's still pretty wet yeah but i put them in like in the shower like yeah. that's how my hair turns out good okay guys so we are in the bathroom now and i'm about to do my brother's hair hair routine there's not much to do in the shower because all i use is this conditioner so i'm just gonna get my hair wet put the conditioner in let it sit for a little bit and then detangle my hair and then i'll just get out of the shower and use his styling product <laughs> Okay guys, so I now have the Aussie conditioner sitting in my hair. I'm gonna let this sit in my hair for about five minutes while I just do everything else in the shower and then I'll rinse it out. So I am now out of the shower. My hair is already so much drier than it would usually be when I put products in. So we're gonna go ahead and put the leave-in conditioner and coconut oil in. He, like my brother, literally just gets it and he goes like this, but my hair is obviously not just on the top of my head. So I guess I'll just, oh my God, this product is so thick. I forgot about that. My hair is getting like thicker as we speak because it's drying really fast. This actually doesn't feel horrible in my hair. It's really thick though. Okay, make sure we moisturize all the hair. Why am I not mad at how this looks? I guess a little bit won't hurt. I don't know how much he puts in, but I don't think it's a whole lot. Okay, and I guess now I'll just let my hair air dry. <clears throat>
Okay guys, so it's now my turn. I've never done this before, okay? Okay, it's my turn now. I got all the products right here. So I'm just gonna get ready, you know what I'm saying? I underestimated how weird this would be. So obviously I gotta wet my hair and everything first. Water's literally getting everywhere. How do you film these? Let me wet my hair a little bit more. Now we got the shampoo right here. Oh my god, guys. The door wasn't locked that whole time. I don't have the cover thing. Someone's gonna just walk in. That's horrifying. Okay, so I got the conditioner now. I'm just gonna put this in. I don't know how many pumps to do. This should be good enough. I'm still shook over the fact that the door wasn't even locked. That's ridiculous. Okay. Oh, I forgot to focus the shampoo on my scalp. It's not too big of a deal though. Okay, so I put it all in my hair, so I'm just gonna just let it sit for five minutes now. Taking showers is a lot less enjoyable without the curtain. My worst fear right now is that while I'm closing my eyes to do whatever, like I didn't lock it in enough so the camera just drips down. That's like my worst fear. Fast, 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 Diana. Okay, so I think that was like five minutes. I think that was long enough. So I'm just gonna wash this out now. Okay, so now I'm done with like the two main things which is shampoo and conditioner. So now I think, I don't really remember that clearly, but I think right now, bring out my hair and start putting in like the leave-in conditioner and stuff. Okay, so now we have the blueberry bliss leave-in conditioner stuff. I don't know how much to do. I'll do like that much. It smells like blueberry. I didn't finger detangle my hair. I still gotta do that. Okay, I'm just gonna rinse it out again, and then I'll put more leave-in conditioner in. I'm wasting our product, but it's whatever. Okay, so now I'm gonna wring it out again, and then put the leave-in conditioner back in. I don't do my hair routine in the shower. I actually typically do it out of the shower, but I don't know. This is different. We got the leave-in conditioner, so now I'm going to use, like, the Miss Jessie stuff. What even is this? I don't know. Just, like, a curl cream? I don't even know what this is. And I don't know how much to use either. I'll use, like, that much. I feel like it's kind of a lot. So now I'm gonna use the, this curl maker stuff, four pumps, no idea. I don't know how much portion of the products has to do with how it turns out. Now I'm ready to move on to the Eco Styling Gel right here. It's turning out pretty good so far. Just looking at it right now, I can see that the curls are pretty defined. We're gonna have to see what it looks like when it dries up. I don't know if this is all mine or both of ours, but that's a lot of hair right there. Ew, okay. The door wasn't locked for like half I an hour. I heard that. Okay, I can't even get my hair to look good for like this clip. My hair's mm -hmm. been drying for like 30 minutes. So far, my hair's feeling really crusty. My curls are like not there. They're not defined and my hair's greasy. We'll be getting back in the shower to fix this because this is not cutting it. So how are you feeling? I feel good. You know, my hair feels pretty moisturized. It looks good. I feel pretty healthy. It feels a lot like when I was touching it, it feels a lot more dense with products. More I'm surprised that makes you feel more dense. My products make your hair feel more dense? Yeah. The reason my curls aren't defined is because he doesn't use any curl definition products. Like, it was just leaving conditioner and oil. My hair looks like I got a really shitty haircut. Anyways, we will get back to you guys once our hair is dry. So, probably like an hour. Okay, guys. So, it is about an hour later and this is what our hair is looking like now. What are your final thoughts? It feels fine right now. It feels normal. The curls seem pretty defined. I'm gonna have to see a close up on them to see like yeah. How defined they really are and like how much frizz there is in comparison to my normal routine, okay. but it seems really good. My hair, it got a little better as it dried. It doesn't look as greasy now, but it is still really oily and my curls are not defined because I used no styling products. But overall, like it's not horrible, but it's not my favorite. Wouldn't do again. I'll stick to my routine, but like. Yeah. <laughs> I'm going to integrate some things from her routine into my routine. I'm going to actually get some curl defining cream. Yeah. I'm going to shampoo it more often. Mm -hmm. I didn't really get the scalp. Not shampoo did I forgot to I use the styling gel pretty infrequently so yeah I'll use that more often the styling gel and the curl defining cream I'll use those two that's what I'll take from this yeah and I'll take nothing okay guys so we have come to the end of this video I really hope you guys enjoyed it let me know how you think both of our hair turned out also if you didn't know my brother has a YouTube channel so make sure to check him out I'll have all his links down below if you guys have gotten all the way to the end of this video and you have not subscribed yet please make sure to do so also if you enjoyed the video don't forget to give it a big thumbs up thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye! <laughs>